This is Lee Sterling of Paramount Sports, and we are finishing watching the University of Miami scrimmage, the second of two scrimmages here. This is at Traz Powell Field, and see a lot of good and a lot of bad. A good new regime, Al Golden, new coaches, it's got to be worth at least a touchdown compared to last year. Also, the running back position looks spectacular. They have four or five running backs. The negative, linebacking position still isn't there. Backup receivers is not there. Cornerback position looks to be in disarray. They don't have a real true starter there. Kicking game is a problem. The kicking game uh, could be some real problems at the kicker and punter position unless they get someone to fill in for Bosher. And also, the biggest negative, no real quarterback. Jacory Harris or Stephen Morris do not look like they're ready to step up and be prime time players. So, what you have is a Miami team that's going to get better and better because of coaching and recruiting, but just does not have the frontline players and the depth to compete and beat the best teams. Miami, a team that probably will end up winning seven or eight games this year. We're looking for Miami to get better as the years go on, but they're not ready to compete with the big dogs yet. Seven or eight win season for the Miami Hurricanes and a minor bowl. This is our second stop of what will be many, many spring games and fall camps. We'll check with you later in the spring and in the fall. And Miami Hurricanes looking good, but not where they were eight or ten years ago.